Hello, my name is Errol, and this is my first Vita uh, vlog every day in April post. And I was, you know, wanted to see if there was like some sort of website or something about it that I could find online, but I couldn't find like some sort of like www.vita.com. No, nothing. Not that I found. I didn't really look really hard, but I was hoping, you know, the very first link that you would actually get if you were to like look up vlog every day in April would be that website, but it wasn't. Found a bunch of other websites of other people doing this, and so it's not something I just made up. I learned it from uh, Jen or My Sheree. You can find her on Facebook and uh, My Sheree Costumes. And so it's, that's great. She told me about it, and I thought it was awesome. And I thought it'd be really cool. And I asked Manda maybe she should do it too because I was with Manda. We were at actually a sushi place with My Sheree. First time I actually met her, so it was really cool. She's because Manda talks about her all all the time. And if you know me, and if you don't know me, and you're watching this. I don't know why you'd be doing that, but if you do know me and you're watching this, I still don't know why you'd be doing that, but you would know who Manda is, and her friend is Jen. She talks about Jen all the time. They do cosplay together. Well, Manda doesn't do cosplay. My Sheree does cosplay. So she doesn't know how to work leather. I know that part. I, that's, that's kind of awkward, but that's okay. I just, we talked about leather. That... Anyway, I was I was on the internet looking at all the different people doing vlogs, and there are a lot of people that do this. And none of it I really find interesting. So I don't know why I'm doing it. Because I, I, my friends wouldn't really want to watch me talk all day about nothing. I, and I can do that for a really, really long time. I can talk about nothing. And so, I mean, I could, if I wanted to, maybe have some sort of schedule, talk about what I... You know, if you remember back in the day when you used to watch some like Mork and Mindy and and Mork, at the very end, would have some sort of monologue that would have the moral of the day. Or even when you'd watch Perfect Strangers. And I remember at the very end, whatever his name is, Larry, I can't remember. He would, uh, like, pontificate on what he learned during that day. And it's always the same thing he learned that he learned from Balki, his cousin. It wasn't really very original, but I kept watching it every day. I could remember, like, all the theme songs from, from 80s sitcoms it's kind of sad isn't it i thought that'd be a really cool video actually to do the the dance for the bill cosby show but i didn't do it because i'd have to get my kids involved and it's hard sometimes getting them involved because then they because i have to bribe them i have to bribe them with like candies not ponies they don't believe me when i try to bribe them but you have to be you have to follow through with a bribe sadly and i don't do that either this has gone on for three minutes. I couldn't believe I could go. I mean, I'm really tired, and I've got so much. The reason I'm doing, the reason I'm doing uh, Vita is because I have many, many, many things to do in April, and so it would be kind of cool to actually have something to talk about. For for example, one thing I'm doing right now is trying to uh, fill out this application forms or for some uh, music funding. We're hopefully going to fund uh, our CD opening release party. And so my sister's really good at filling out forms. She's like a doctor. And I think that's what they really do is they just fill out paperwork. And she's good at that. And she likes doing it too. So she fills out forms for me and I'm not complaining. And she's good. She just tells me what to get and I give it to her and she fills them out. Okay, and you would think, oh, forms are so easy. Forms are not easy for me. I look at a form, you know, you go to the dentist and they give you a form. And you go, oh, man. And it's just, it's information you know, like your name. And what you'd like to be called, Mr. or Mrs. and your birth date. But I don't know. You, you give me a form and I feel like, oh, no, i got to fill out the form. It's like, it can be depressing. Anyway, she's good at filling out forms, though. And putting together budgets and doing all sorts of all that admin stuff. I have no skills in that whatsoever. Anyway, that's what we're doing. And I figured every day I could probably talk about what I did during the day. I went for dim sum. That was awesome. And then we were supposed to go out for Korean barbecue, but we didn't. My wife forgot we were going to do that. My kids have been begging. Did you know, I'm sorry, I, I kind of like get distracted because I realize that the TIFF Lightbox Theater is doing this whole Miyazaki run thing and then showing all the Miyazaki films on the big screen and I think I've missed them all. Because <sighs> I've been so busy. It's just making me sad. I wanted to go and see Totoro on the big screen. Oh, I wanted to take my kids to go see Totoro on the big screen. But I didn't. I'm going to have to. Anyway, 
to get back to this document. I actually, they're filling the document out now and uh, they're probably asking me questions. I have it on my second monitor over here. Oh look, nope, nobody's asking me questions yet. All good. But I, I should finish this vlog up because it's gone on for five minutes. I was surprised I can get this much. I, I shouldn't be surprised I could talk about it, but you know, tangents come into my head. My own podcast, the one that I do with Jamez, Errol and the Bald Guy. He doesn't like it when I tangent as much either. And so, you know, maybe I should just tangent on my own. But it's not as fun to tangent when nobody's giving me anything to tangent off of. So I have to tangent off of myself and see what actually just comes into my head. Like Gilligan's Island just popped in for some strange reason. Maybe it's because I'm wearing red. Could be it. Didn't watch much of that. I actually didn't really see the huge joy in Gilligan's Island. I don't, I mean, I did watch a lot of it, but, you know, he always screwed up and it's just depressing. It's like Sisyphus. I did like a lot of Greek myths, though. Playing a lot of Draw Something, too, by the way. And I would tell you what my name is on Draw Something, but now I'm up to like 10 people. And it's hard to keep up with Draw Something, even though I only do it once a day now because I have 10 people. It's just... Uh. I liked it though. There was another one I did. I can't remember what it was. But you know, you could get different brushes. That was nice. I mean, actually, I kind of like the fact that you've got the simple brush. I don't really need any more brushes. Or actually, I would like it better if you could, like, delete some colors. Or no, a favorite palette. I wonder if they have a favorite palette. That would be cool. Anyway, sorry. It's seven minutes. I should really try and keep these under 10. I will talk to you later. Good night, and thanks for watching my blog. I'm probably past 12. I'm just, yeah, it still counts as April 1st for me. Sorry that I didn't get a comic out this weekend. I've been busy, tired, emotional even. Bye-bye.